All right, all right, boss up, boss up, baby. You know, we back with another one. Help you guys find these gig jobs, these transportation jobs, you no know, delivery gigs, anything to help you level up out the nine to five rat racing, be your own boss, be on hustle, be on funds, be on bank. That's what we about. So let's get into it. No long talk, no long intro. We got a great company here going making $40 plus an hour, being a seasonal worker with a large company the biggest company the biggest brand delivery brand in the land and i got an email last night from none other than you oh, there we go. You went away. no longer other than ups and they mentioned that they are starting their seasonal jobs are now open how about that so um i've been signed up with them for about two years now um Around this time, have tons of other things going on, so I haven't signed up to be a seasonal driver yet. I'm gonna try to get on this year, and but I'm still gonna leave, bring y'all the information. And I found a gig tuber on YouTube that's already doing that, so we're gonna look at her and see what her experience is with that. But let's talk about the job in itself. So when they send me the email saying it's open, um, I can register for like an online job fair, online job career. And they are going to, uh, once I sign up for that, it's a video they can play to get more information. And if I am further interested, I can apply. So here's what the events are. They got Browns Day. So here are all the days they're doing the information session. So you're in Savannah. I think these are actually live information sessions. So they do have online information sessions and in-person info sessions. So here are, you know, some Savannah, Georgia, Illinois, Massachusetts, Arkansas, Vermont. Right. So the guy even got Vermont in the house, so you can select your state and see where all they doing stuff from. I always get messages and texts from the state of Texas. So shout out to y'all, but guess what? <laughs> Texas is not even on here. Oh, y'all can't see the drop down box. The drop down is not showing up on the screen, but Texas, it goes Tennessee, Utah. Okay. All right. So UPS is not big in uh, Texas. Uh, Virginia area is another state. So Virginia is on here. So they do got some stuff in Virginia area, Springfield, Alexandria area, and all that good stuff. So check them out. And then uh, here is the seasonal support driver. Build your career. Look at that blonde lady. And she ain't looking like she picking up too much heavy stuff. So. It's real light work, small packages that you're delivering, envelopes, letters, you know, small Amazon and Walmart packages that you get ordered. Build your career from the car. You're not going to build a career of being a seasonal worker. But all right, so that's what they're saying. Seasonal work. Uh, how many deliveries? What's the qualifications? 21 and older, lifts 70 pounds. Uh, depends on your route. You wear a uniform, we provide uniform and a vest. You'll see that later. Uh, your car must be registered and reliable, closed, covered top, or covered bed. So if you are driving a pickup truck, if you are driving a pickup truck, you need to have your bed covered and be able to lock and no other company logos. So no FedEx, no Amazon stickers on your vehicle. Once you're paid, seasonal drivers receive competitive pay which is paid weekly uh also receive a mileage reimbursement and phone stipend so competitive pay I'm not sure what competitive means but what i found in research over the past couple of years is most people who work this job off of glassdoor and linkedin reported that they make around uh, 30 to 40 dollars an hour um they didn't mention some of the uh, mileage reimbursement. So I'm not sure if that was in there or not. And then, so here's some more information about it. Uh, here's some places that are actually hiring. So you can see Florida's on here. Uh, Round Rock, here's actually the Round Rock, Texas. So how many didn't have no info sessions for Texas, but they got actual jobs for Texas. So uh, if you, you know, cut off you turn off the video from Texas, uh, come back. I do got something for you guys. And Colorado, 
some other places. Look at that guy right there. Teamwork makes the dream work. UPS is a great company and during the holidays when everybody is ordering, there's plenty of work and plenty of stuff to get you rolling. And you never know, you know, you could like working for UPS and become full time. And also they got warehouse jobs and other non driving jobs that are seasonal as well. So here is the one for Roswell, Georgia. This is the closest one that's hiring in my area. So I went ahead and uh, looked them up. Seasonal package, lift 70 pounds. Uh, have straight registered vehicle, no other logos. Vehicles under 10,000 pounds. So no box trucks for this one. Uh, shift your benefits. Saturday holiday work may be required. 67 cents per mile, this is good. And then the base pay here in Georgia is $23 an hour. So that's the base pay. You can always ask for more, which I would always ask for more. Um, 23 miles of dollars an hour driving your own vehicle, but you're getting mileage reimbursement. So I think that's where the extra seven to $10 is coming in with the mileage reimbursement you will get that money back and towards your pay. So that works out, all right? So that's the deal with uh, UPS seasonal worker. You see how much they're paying here in Georgia, at least. Different states, of course, California, New York area. Could be more. Some places in the uh, Midwest and other places in the South could be less. Location, location, location matters with this business, all right? And now let's see what this lady has to say. It's 8.40 this morning as a seasonal support driver for UPS. It is now 2.30 in the afternoon. This is my first day, it's Monday, that I'm doing a solo route. I trained on Friday with a couple of people. So it's been interesting today. So, I'm so she got one day of training on Friday and then went out on her own on Monday. Right. That's a pretty quick turnaround. I'm going to keep it real. It is a little hectic in the organizational area. I was sent to a distribution center where I trained and I was supposed to pick up my packages in my initial route today. And when I got there, they're like, oh no, your packages are on a UPS truck. We're going to go have you meet that driver back in the area where you live and mind you my house is 15 miles away from the distribution center so not that far so I drove back to my area and I waited in a parking lot for a while almost an hour and then I finally met up with the UPS driver I was supposed to unload some of his packages to help him out and he's looking through all his truck and he's like yeah your packages aren't here so we had to call up the distribution center and they're like, oh, wait, your packages are on a different truck. Can you go meet this other UPS driver um, not too far away, maybe five miles away? You know? Hey, guys. If All right. So, oops. Went off that. Okay. I thought it might be fun or but, educational uh, to record my. Okay. So, yeah, that was an experience right there. Um, I wouldn't particularly uh, be thrilled about having to go back towards my house, wait for an hour and still not get the packages I need to deliver to do my job, which is going to prolong her day and what she needs to do. She could have been halfway done with her route, but she has to prolong it. So yeah, UPS seems like they have some organizational issues, some things you got to deal with, especially being with the seasonal driver. You know, you're going to get the, the worst routes. Uh, some of the, you know, like I said, you're a new employee, so you have to wait for that person to, you know, even show up and help them unload just to find out your package is not there. So these are some of the things that she dealt with. She has to go to the warehouse in the morning, supposed to pick it up, but that wasn't there. So you got to be flexible. You got to be willing to know how to uh, think on the fly, not get frustrated, and uh, make sure you got a plenty of availability and free time while doing this job. It looks like they CPS going to run you around all over the place. Let's kind of fast forward and see what else she says. Uh, I was told that dog bites can happen and sometimes people don't have their unruly dogs chained up. So everything's been good so far. It is a lot of hustle and bustle. It's a little chilly out there, but I've already mastered their 
their system here um, and I feel good about it. So I'm gonna keep going and I'll check in at the end of this and then we'll see where I'm at step one. So here real quick, I wanted to show you guys what their system looks like. They have a GPS system, a map system. It's pretty organized. It so that looks like either on fleet was another app I was using for a while, Metro, something like that. Uh, once you got into some pay. I'm gonna go eat right now, pet my dog dogs, and you do try to be available as much as you can. Remember, this is a temporary position. It's only for like six to eight weeks. For me, it's gonna be eight weeks. I got onboarded earlier than most. So I wanna milk it. I wanna make as much money as I can and work as much, as many hours as I can. So um, I think that's about it. All right, so that's the content creator. Her name is Madeline Jean Antiques and Restoration. Random title for a video about UPS driving. Uh, maybe the antiques business not going so well. You got to pick up plans yourself. And this is actually from last year. This is 11 month old video. So she probably got on 11 months. She would have got on in October, early October. And um, she's starting to get rolling now. Not sure where she is, why it's so cold. And, uh, october or november but um but yeah that's where she is with it so go ahead and sign up today get in there early like she see she got rolled in early so she's going to get her full eight weeks working the seasonal position all right but until next time it's your boy be easy boss up boss up with k man hit me up on instagram if you need a consultation if you need a credit advice um need help finding stuff in your area shoot me a message I'll try to help you out if we need to book a consultation. Only 50 bucks for one hour and you get to talk to me and ask me any question you got. All right. All right. Until next time, man. UPS seasonal work. Let's get it.